we have a period now which is disinflationary. But the problem is if the stock market keeps going up and all of a sudden we have less restrictive monetary conditions, then we're going to be back at the same place we were before, which is money sloshing around into all kinds of risky assets or more money. You know, there's still an enormous amount of money sitting on the sidelines that has to come into the market now if this thing keeps going higher. So we're in a delicate moment. And if we reignite inflation because all of a sudden more companies have more liquidity that they can tap, more money they can raise, more money as a result that they can spend, because we don't have this first inflationary cycle under control, there could be a risk that, that we reignite inflation. And so then they have to capitulate, the Fed has to capitulate again and start another hiking cycle. So I think it's a complicated moment. I think all of the smart money in Wall Street that I talked to up until this point, they forecasted like this period would be choppy and the second half of the year would be really robust and like you needed to be super long and things were going to be incredible. 